Tonight in Concord, a push to change a city ordinance some business owners say is costing them money. The city has detailed rules about how businesses can display their signs. One of them, window signs, are only allowed on the first floor of buildings, but businesses downtown on the second floor say this puts them at an unfair disadvantage. WCNC Charlotte's Julia Kaufman is in Concord with the story. These large decals are perfectly fine on this shop's windows because it's on the ground level. But for any businesses on the second floor, Concord's ordinance says their windows must stay clear. We spoke with one owner who says he's being fined $3,000 for violating that rule. With construction on Union Street blocking stores and the second floor not getting as much foot traffic, Owner of U.S. Bonding, Jason Cunningham, says these signs are paramount for his business. If you can't find the business, you can't find the location, how are you going to survive? Cunningham says he's displayed window signs since 2010 with no problems. But in January, he got this violation from the city, fining him $100 a day until he takes them down. I do feel singled out. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate the business, okay? The cigar loft next door also has been asked to take its signs down. Owner Derek Kilgore says he's complying, but worries what it'll do to sales. Well, I just feel like I should have the same rights and privileges as a business on the ground floor. The ordinance says instead, second floor businesses can have signs on exterior walls or hanging ones. What's the difference having a sign stuck on glass versus a sign the same size stuck on brick? A city spokesperson tells WCNC Charlotte, quote, staff has met on site with business owners found to be in violation to assist them and help identify solutions, adding that the city has a grant program to help pay for new signage. The ordinance says the purpose is to maintain and enhance the aesthetic environment of Concord and to improve pedestrian and traffic safety. But it doesn't make sense to Cunningham or Kilgore. I just think we need to take another look at it as a city. Kilgore and Cunningham plan to talk to city council about amending the ordinance to make things fairer for second level businesses. In downtown Concord, Julia Kaufman, WCNC Charlotte.